Hi, I'm Tony D. Today we're going to work on grounding ourselves and letting go of all of that stress and extra energy. That's right, extra energy. You know, the extra energy that everyone says they have, I have so much energy, it's actually worse sometimes than not having enough energy. So let's work on that today. I'd like you to stand with this much room all the way around you with your feet about shoulders width apart, approximately, toes pointed forward, knees slightly bent. Put your hips out, all right? Relax your shoulders, and there you go, standing up straight. Skyhook your head as if you're being lifted up to heaven, okay? Don't throw your shoulders back, don't push your chest out, kind of round them, there we go. All right, breathe in, breathe out, and just relax for a moment. Allow yourself to settle into the place where you're standing. Shake it out, okay? And let's start with the arms dangling as if they're not connected, back and forth, just twisting around. I always close my eyes and imagine as a child spinning like a top all around the yard. Just imagine yourself letting go of all that stress from the top of your head, out your arms, out your fingers, into the ground, and all of that stress and energy coming down through you and into the earth. Good. And just relax. Breath in breath out. Good. Taking your hands, facing it down to the earth. Imagine you're connecting to the earth. Let's move it around. Like swirling soup. Like stirring coffee. Imagine it's like clouds all around you. Let's breathe in and bring that energy up as if it's magnetically connected to our fingers all the way up to our heart center and relax for a moment and then let it out nice and slow down to the ground and spread it out again. Breathe into the heart. Breathe out through your feet. Imagine you're breathing in from the earth and breathing back out through your feet. Breathe in from your nose, if you can. Breathe out through your feet. Now I want you to imagine scooping up that energy from the earth, all that positive energy, and bring it up to the heart. Turn your hands over and slowly let it out, putting it back down. Feel it going through your body, through your legs, through your feet and into the earth. Good. One more time. Breathe in. Turn it over and push it out. Good. Swirl the energy around and imagine your feet are growing great roots into the earth. You're grounding yourself in your mind. And what your mind perceives, your body achieves. Allow that to happen. Good. We're going to scoop up that energy now, breathing in, bring it up to the heart. Now turn your hands face outwards in front of your heart and push that energy out with your breath. Turn your hands face inwards and breathe into your heart. downward and push out through your feet, breathing out, breathe into the heart, breathe out from the heart, breathe into the heart, breathe out through your feet and into the earth. Your breath is the most important thing you have. You can't go a moment without breathing. 
where your breath comes in and mixes with the blood and oxygenates your blood, your energy that you push through your body, your chi, okay? Where your chi goes, blood flows. So does lymphatic fluids. So what you're doing is you're healing yourself, whether you know it or not, while you're doing these simple exercises and just breathing. But we're moving that energy too with our mind and using our bodies. So now, swirling that energy around. Scoop it up, breathe in, push it out. Nice and slow. Turn it around, breathe in. Breathe out through your feet into the earth. Now, scoop up that energy, breathe into the heart. This time we're gonna turn our hands over, facing out, and push the energy away. Now turn your hands face forward and bring it into the heart. Breathing in and push it back down into the earth. With all of these movements, anytime we come towards the heart, we're breathing in. Anytime we're going away from the heart, we're breathing out. So breathe into your heart center. Push it out to the world. Turn the hands around. Bring it into the heart. Push it back down into the earth. And one more time. Breathe in. Elbows up. Breathe out. Hands face out, breathe in. Hands face down, relax your shoulders, relax your arms, breathe out. One more time. In, shoulders up, breathe out. Hands face out, breathe in. Shoulders down, elbows relaxed, wrists relaxed, breathe out. And just relax. Feel your shoulders relaxing. Feel your hips relaxing, your knees. Don't lock those knees. Keep them slightly bent. Good. Now, breathe in, scooping up the energy from the earth. Feel it coming up through your feet, through your base chakra, your sacral chakra solar plexus chakra up to the heart center. Bring it out like a cup in front of you and raise that energy up to your throat, up to the third eye. Bring your hands around and push it up from the crown straight up above you. And breathe out with your hands face down back to the earth. Breathe in. Push it all the way up, breathe out. Don't worry about fully extending. I have an injured shoulder, so I can't even bend my arm up too high without it hurting. That's what I'm working on, moving that chi through the energy, through my hand that I got crushed, <laughs> and getting the fingers to move. And I'm imagining that energy working all the time. I had a big back injury. I was told back in 1986 that I was going to be paralyzed in a wheelchair for the rest of my life. What I do now is because of what I did then. All right? I learned to heal myself moving my own energy and using Reiki, the energy from the universe, to heal myself. We're all healers. All right? there's, there's no such thing as somebody healing somebody else. We work as facilitators to help others learn how to heal themselves. If you don't want to heal, you won't. There's no doctor in the world, no medication, no surgery, no voodoo, nothing that could be done, not even a priest, if you don't want it yourself. This is all about you as an individual. Okay, so let's bring that energy up. Push it up to the heavens and let it Cross your arms in front of you 
and turn the hands face upward. Pull the energy up from the earth, all the way up into prayer position above the head, okay? And bring that energy down through the crown, the third eye, through your eyes. Feel the heat against your face of your own energy flowing through your throat, through your lungs, through your digestive tract, through your sex organs, down through your legs, your knees, and into your feet, and into the ground. Again, breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. stand for a moment and feel yourself in the presence of the present moment. Isness. Being present in the here and now. Whatever happened in the past doesn't matter at this moment. Whatever is coming in the future we have no control of and it doesn't matter. It's not here and now. The past and the future are only in your mind. So they're fictitious. They don't really exist. The only reality is now. And so now you are relaxed. Now you're breathing easy. Now you feel no stress. I want to watch, what I want you to do is imagine yourself, your energy in this one space where you're standing. I want you to take a step backward, away from that energy you were. And imagine that energy is still there. That was the old you. This is the new you. And with your hands and your arms, like a giant pair of scissors, cut away from above all the way to the ground. Cut away from that old energy, all the way down to the ground. Cut it away. It's no longer part of you. It's all the connections to the outside world now that you've cut away from. All of those people that have been clinging to you for the answers, for you to do this and that, and blah, blah, blah. It's all disconnected. It's all about you. And in your space and in your time. So now what you have done is you've created a protection from within. So now feel that like a bubble all the way around you as you do this work. Feel that bubble that you've created around you. This is your protection. Nothing is allowed in unless you allow it. So as you feel safe and secure in your energy at this very moment, hold that forward. Till next time. I'm Tony D.